What is up guys? How's it going? Welcome to the BNC. If you guys can see, here we are in the new studio where we can have BMX weeklies or any kind of uh, talk segment or anything like that. Is we can do it right here. I got a nice uh, S&M Cameron Wood frame. Cardinal custom powder coated. We have the torture bike. The next episode of the torture series is getting ready to come out here really soon. But yeah, we're in the new area where we're going to film. So I hope you guys like it. And uh, that... That up there was a like a logo picture that was made for me by a friend of mine named Austin Norris. So shouts out to you, Austin Norris. He was actually in our very first video. Well, the first webisode video where he's where he fell off the longboard and slammed his head. It's pretty funny. I might put a clip of it up there. Yeah, we can all laugh about that. It was pretty funny. He was okay, though. But, yeah, he actually drew that one day when he was bored in class and uh, just trying to help out with the channel. Um, since the passing of my father, pretty much the only thing that I just have the desire to do is uh, buckle down in life and just work really hard on the things that I love because that's what my father would have wanted me to do. So that is why I'm coming out with this video right here. So what's gonna happen in the future with this channel is a lot of things i'm going to be taking on a couple other channels and doing this channel at the same time because you know i'm not really gonna use this i don't want to use this as an example but let's say adam lz for example or caleb kwanbeck or you know a couple of them they started in bmx and they really gathered their fans and their viewership and their fan base off of a certain subject and then their channel kind of uh, shifted into a different channel. Like their channel started as like almost like sports channels for like a certain little niche. And then they realized they wanted to make more money and they wanted to, you know, have more viewers and appeal to a broader audience. So they decided to transition their channels into like live vlogging about all different types of stuff cars and BMX and traveling and fixing things you know they just decided to do that with their one channel and that's usually the way people go it's smart business wise it's, it's good to do that because you appeal to a broader audience and your channel can just uh, explode but with this channel what I want to do is anything that uh, my my landlord's actually mowing outside so sorry if you guys hear the mower he actually just came around back the thing about this channel is I'm going to keep it strictly BMX anything that is not BMX related I'm actually going to start a different channel now this new channel uh, if you guys don't know everybody calls me lad lad's my middle name everybody calls me lad that's like my nickname so this new channel is just going to be a channel named a normal lad and that's all it's gonna be it's just gonna be everything in my life that doesn't have to do with BMX. It's not going to take away from the BMX channel. It's not going to take away from the time that I put in the BMX channel. It'll just be for subjects and things. And if you guys kind of enjoy my personality or, you know, what I bring personally to these videos, if you guys like that, then you'll probably enjoy the new channel where I'm just going to do all types of random stuff that really just have nothing to do with BMX. And also the New Age Time Lapse channel. That is also going to be another channel that's going to be about nature and watching the world speed by you and just uh, kind of gathering a different perspective of looking at this earth and nature and things like that. But as far as this channel is concerned, I wanted to come out with this just to talk about a few things. I mean, I guess we can get into a couple comments. Uh, I wanted to talk about that. The comments. I have really been spending a lot of time commenting and helping a lot of people that have questions. And the thing is, is this is a community channel. I'm going to kind of start to del delete my responses. I really want this to be a community channel where once we start getting more viewers and more people watching, I would like to have a lot of other people out there and you guys going through the comments and answering questions and being able to just start this community and help people out from you know the knowledge that you guys know because I mean I might have some knowledge up here in my head I might have a little bit I might be dumb might be smart but you guys can powerfully work 
with more information and help people a lot better than just singly me. And it, it's also kind of weird where I respond to every single comment because it's not really something a lot of YouTubers do. And from me responding to every single comment, there's sometimes comes some controversy in what I say. And also, so I feel like some people don't want to respond to somebody asking a question and don't want to chime in because they feel like I've already answered the question. So I'm just slowly gonna moderate the comments and I'm gonna go through all 130 videos, I think, and just slowly start moderating the comments and hitting that heart button on all the ones that I like because I have not done that yet. And that's actually gonna take some time. So this weekend is Cornhucket in Nebraska at the Nowhere Compound. I might not be able to make it just because of everything that's been going on and the money that I had to spend because of the unfortunate things that happened. You know, I don't even know. I wanna film the eclipse. The eclipse is on Monday. If you guys didn't know, if you look on a map, I live in Southern Illinois. And where I live in Southern Illinois is actually the maximum totality across the whole swipe of the United States. We're supposed to have the longest exposure time of totality or whatever you call it here in the United States. And actually Ozzy Osbourne is having a concert like five miles up the road from my house at the winery. So it's going to be really awesome. It's like probably going to be a once in a lifetime. Well, in 2020, I'll be able to watch it again. But it's technically like a once in a lifetime event where I can film it, especially for the new age nature time lapse. And that's actually on Monday. And the Nowhere Compound is about 10 hours away from me, and that's on Saturday. I'm really gonna try to go to Cornhucket, but in all honesty, I have four bald tires, and I just had to plug one of my tires twice in my car. And here soon, we are going to have the next episode of the Torture Series, where we are going to drop this bicycle right here off of this cliff onto this uh, gravel road that goes underneath it. And it's, I mean, at least 100 feet. Those are just some things coming up. And if you guys want to hear about what happened to my dad, it's really an interesting story now that I think about it. Seriously, just sitting down and talking to you guys about life and the importance of it. If you guys want to just hear about what happened, I will go ahead and start my other channel and just throw that video down so you guys can watch it. But I'm going to keep it away from this BMX channel because the BMX channel should stay BMX. Everything else should be a different channel. I'm actually getting ready to go to work. What time is it? I actually have to be at work here in about 30 minutes. So I'm gonna have to hurry up, put everything in the computer, put everything on the hard drive, hopefully get to work on time, and then when I get off of work, later tonight, probably about like 9, 10 o'clock, then I can make this video and upload it. Uh, hopefully I won't have it uploaded really late. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. That's just a little talk about what's going on, and I will catch you guys in the next video here on the BMX News Channel. Peace.